वेलकम बैक इन टूडेज वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू आर इनकम एंड एक्सपेंस मैनेजमेंट वेब एप डैशबोर्ड विच इज क्रिएटेड बाय यूजिंग द गूगल शीट एंड गूगल वेब एप स्क्रिप्ट सो आई जस्ट कॉपी माय यूजर नेम फॉर द एडमिन एंड पेस्ट इट हियर दिस विल कम विद द एडमिन और अ लिमिटेड यूजर मींस अ यूजर ओके सो एज ऑफ नाउ यू कैन सी हियर दिस इज आवर एडमिन डैशबोर्ड लुक सो यू कैन सी हियर द फाइनेंशियल ओवरव्यू हियर द टोटल इनकम the pkr pakistani rupees okay how it will convert we use the api keys to convert the prices from usdt to local currencies automatically okay the total expense the available balance which we have right now the pending payments which we have in our vendors account but not coming in our accounts yet okay yes so you can understand better ओके तो दिस इज द आवर इनकम ब्रेकडाउन इन फ्रीलांस कैटेगरी वी हैव स्पेंड वी हैव अर्न द 49.68 यूएसडीटी इन इन्वेस्टमेंट वी हैव अर्न द 1.68 इन बिजनेस वी हैव अर्न द 37 ओके तो सेम वी हैव एक्सपेंस ब्रेकडाउन इन एजुकेशन वी स्पेंड 10 यूएसडीटी इन यूपीआई पेमेंट्स वी स्पेंड वी स्पेंड 20 यूएसडीटी ओके सो नाउ लेट्स स्टार्ट Uh, the main things of this web application uh, you can see here this is a add new income we have a uh, we have years are uh, three drop downs the payment method and the currency and the category right now currency is not shown because currency is dependent on the payment method for example upi only accept the inr okay paypal accept inr or usd okay both payments can accept so how you can add your your payment methods so just go to your manage categories come here the drop down the payment methods right now i just click uh, i just delete this and i will add a uh, one data for you okay right now i am going to add the binance here okay binance is the international okay it will accept the usd okay it will accept the usd comma it will accept the pkr comma it will accept the indian rupees comma it will accept the bangladeshi taka okay now you just click on this add so when you click on this add you can see here the payment method is added successfully go to your add income section just select here the binance you can see here all the four currencies in the drop down we just select here Here, uh, we just select here the I N R. Okay, why I choose this I N R? Because I wanna show you something here. Okay, you receive a four ninety nine rupees from a customer in India. Okay, right now it will apply the twenty percent tax. So you can see here the total amount is three four ninety nine. Okay, the tax is this. and the net amount is this and the usdt will become of this particular amount is this how it will calculate we use the real time api keys okay uh, the category is salary freelance salary business now i select a rental okay and click on this add income so when i click on this add income so my income is added successfully go to our main dashboard when we come our main dashboard you can see here the rental categories we have earned the 4.64 usdt okay so when you go to your currency converter you can easily see here one usdt is equals to 86.11 and one usd one usdt to bangladeshi taka and the upi rate we constant use for usdt which is in the binance is 95 okay now again you can see here as we have a category here's we have a category of the income how you can add more categories go to your manage categories and you can add here the more categories what you want for example sample okay and when you click on this add it will add it in your income categories okay sample is added come here and you can check here the sample is added successfully okay same like you can add the expense categories like you can just select here the food and dining how much amount you have spended the 1500 okay which amount you have uh, paid the uh, pkr select method which method you use the cash okay the status is paid 
received available yes or no if you want to add a description you can add the description and click on this add expense so you can see here I will I select uh, the other things there's bills and utilities and click on this add expense so when I click on this add expense my 5.30 USDT after converging my 1500 PKR to the USDT okay now go to our main dashboard you can see here bills and utilities it is we have spent it 5.30 5 5.30 5.30 USD okay now go to our income history when we go to the our income history you can see here this is a amount which is currently in our friends account because we don't have the PayPal account it's our friend account so they will have in their account mine 60 USDT payment and they will uh, they will get the 12 USDT as a commission and 48 USDT they will give out to you okay now it's in the pending state okay you can see here and again you can apply the same filters the pending apply filters you can easily uh, apply out the filter to see the pending one okay one thing more if you have received the amount from your vendor or your agent you can simply click on this icon to make it from pending to received okay now it will from pending to received okay so you can see here the 48 usdt is received to your account okay you can see here received now go to your dashboard you can see here your pending payment is now only the 6.32 usdt okay same here the in the expense category when you come here you can just select uh, you, you can just check here the paid amount or something like that it, it will not have uh, the exchange features okay now the main category comes friend debts for example for example uh, for example I come with my friends and uh, go for a food like uh, we are going to HN foods for uh, uh, for eating the dinner okay so we have total amount we have spent is uh, 15,000 rupees okay uh, we have spent the PKR INR okay now we have uh, the five friends for example me okay this 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 or this we have a uh, for type what time i paid for friends or i borrowed money from the friends right now i paid for friends i just select here i paid for friends and click on this add debt record so when i click on this add debt record so as of now you can able to see each person will have the 2500 rupees comes in this dinner okay so when i receive the payment from all of my friends and I just simply swap the pending status to set it okay so now the status is set it now no one gives me money because all the friends give me the money okay so hope you can understand this now come to the users dashboard we just click on this log out and just log out there as of now you can see here in the income Binance also have but this is a user which can only able to see the UPI or PayPal. We just come here and log in to our details. Okay. So when we uh, enter our details here. Okay. I just copy this and paste it here and keep on this sign. So when I click on this sign in as of now you can able to see this is a limited user cannot have the lot of functionalities which are admin for the ad income expense nothing can see them you just go to their income history go to your, their dashboard right now you can able to see this person this person have the 51 this person have the 51.36 USDT as a income how will this come one logic I want to show you right now in our uh, admin dashboard we have mark this received but that's our mistake we don't need to mark this received we just come here our income and just come here 
and just paste it here and go to our go to our the dashboard so as of now you can able to see when i refresh my data so now it will be in the pending state i just refresh my web application to show you it will again in the pending state when we go to our income history so you can see here now this user can mark the payment transfer okay we just click on this transfer as of now the payment is going to be transferred okay and again uh, you can see here when you go to your dashboard you can able to see now the total income is 3.36 usdt and the pending amount is this okay hope you understand this point hope you got this point okay again when you click on this transfer now 1.68 will be less from there amount as well you can see here pending amount is zero 1.68 is their income okay again in the expense history they can only able to see the upa or paypal expense history and in the currency converter they can able to see the currency conversion rate means this uh, limited user uh, role is for only those persons for example you have a agent in some other countries uh, and uh, for some particular payment methods like in your country paypal is not working and you have a agent uh, in india for the upi or paypal so you can add the your income in your real portal uh, and you can add the upi or paypal but they will this person will able to see the upi or paypal payment they will double verify that payment and transfer to your account and mark the transfer so you will receive the amount you can mark the receipt okay so we thank you very much take care hope you like this video you like this concept